Hey Dad, you're about to see why I'm a teacher instead of a video editor. I did my best, this was the first one I ever made, so I hope you like it. Lauren, Mom and I, we all organized this to show you how much we care about you. Um, thank you to everyone who sent me videos, messages, pictures, whatever it may be. Um, I hope that you have a good day today, the big 6-0, a lot of big things coming up. Uh, you get to go to Market Basket earlier, I think it's 6am, that's exciting for you. Um, get that discount ticket at high school games, that's fun. Um, yeah, it's been great in quarantine. We get to play a little uh, basketball, play horse, I get to beat you in horse, I should say. Uh, we get to play catch, go on lots of walks. All right, enjoy the video. Can't wait to show you so we can have a quarantini with it or uh, maybe just some seltzer and beer. All righty, happy birthday, Dad. I love you. Happy 60th birthday, Dad. I wish I could be there to celebrate you, but we'll celebrate as soon as we can. I love you. Hey little brother, happy birthday, happy 60th birthday. I know it's not gonna be the usual birthday celebrating with everybody, but I hope that uh, you can make the best of it and the best is yet to come. I can't believe how old you are now. <laughs> I wish I was there to give you a big hug and kiss and eventually that'll happen. So anyway, have a happy birthday and I love you. Happy birthday, Brian. Hey, Brian. Just wanted to wish you a happy birthday. I uh, hope you have a great day. Can't wait to watch the Red Sox with you. Hopefully it's sooner rather than later. Have a good day. Happy birthday, Brian. Welcome to the club. Birthday, Brian, from your fellow bandmate Paul. I tell you what, uh, it's happy 60th birthday. We had a lot of fun between us high school buddies, and uh, I tell you what, uh, the first time I met you was in seventh grade. Uh, Mr. Bean was our teacher in woodwork, and I happen to have the first project you made right here. Pretty awesome. Check out all the uh, the, the work you did. Pretty good. I tell you, I had fun playing with uh, playing with you in the fence with the boys. A lot of high school buddies. Uh, I tell you what, uh, when I think of you, they were erections. I mean, when we played for the erections, I tell you, it was a lot of fun. Um, and again, out of all of us, you, you, you're, you're so stable. You're, you're uh, just a great person because I know some of your other high school buddies, including myself, might be off the wall. It's great, Brian. I know your mom, sister Janice, Eileen, Lauren, Catherine, Frankie. What a great family. Just so lucky to have a great family. So proud of you guys, Cal and myself. So... Happy birthday, Brian, again. All right, you're the best. Hey, Brian, happy 60th birthday. Um, I can't believe uh, this day's here for you today and uh, for all of us, uh, all of us friends this year. But uh, when I think back on uh, our friendship together, and it's been over 50 years, I still remember the day I first set eyes on you. I think a story I've told uh, many, many times with, uh, I have a vivid, vivid memory of you uh, standing at the corner as I think a fourth grader 
with your your pearl white shoes and bobby socks and shorts and belt and polo shirt all white like all clorox white and uh, i remember walking up the hill and looking at you and thinking who is that because even back then that was so uncool and uh, but you've obviously turned into a very cool guy a very cool dad a very cool friend uh, over the course of year of, of, of time together but uh, you know as we started circulating all those pictures the last couple of weeks because of the coronavirus it definitely triggered a lot of memories and when I go back in time and at our friendship uh, over 50 years uh, I have some vivid memories of so much fun so many good times and you being just a great friend and, and our bond together uh, when we think about you know whether it was elementary school and, and uh, playing catch uh, out in front of your house and me not having a very accurate arm and you chasing the ball down the street and being very cooperative uh, in that. Uh, to us, um, you know, going to the beach all the time and watching you develop that incredible tan and, and playing gym hockey and, and, you know, very competitive gym hockey. And, I was amazed at your speed and your ability and your determination. And I always remember that, you know, you, you took a lot to piss you off. Uh, but once you're pissed off, I wanted nothing to do with you because you're nasty, uh, especially playing sports when you're pissed off. So, uh, and I saw that a few times in, in gym hockey uh, and other times as well, but uh, uh, to music and you dragging me to some crazy concerts and, you know, I'll never forget you bringing me to Wendy O. Williams and I'm looking at her on the stage going, what is that? Um, anyway, but you enjoyed her. And uh, so I was always happy to go and, and see what uh, type of music you were, um, you know, bringing me to next. Uh, playing softball together, you know, uh, I remember every time a ball was hit, it was, you know, generally a, a tough ball to get in the field and thinking, Brian's gonna track that down because he has incredible speed and and also thinking that thank God that ball wasn't hit the Mac because uh, it would be a home run uh, and easily get by Mac. Um, to us talking about our kids and sports and how our kids were developing and you being a great family man and very dedicated and you and Eileen great raising two terrific daughters and Lauren and Catherine, um, um, you know, to just, getting together and shooting the shit and, and drinking beer and talking sports endlessly. You're probably one of the most knowledgeable sports people I know. Uh, you're always right, it seems like. That's why I asked your opinion, like, okay, uh, but what does Brian think about this and what's gonna happen with the trade or how the team's gonna do or whatever, and you're, you're generally spot on. Um, you're, you're incredible at that. But uh, I wanted to, uh, I mean, I could go on and on and on, but uh, I loved our friendship together. Uh, you're a great friend. You're one of the most considerate people I know. And um, I uh, wish you an incredible birthday, uh, very happy day. And, and we've had a lot of great times together and uh, like the music and one of our favorite songs from the Cars. Uh, we've had a lot of good times. Um, let the good times roll. We have some great times ahead and uh, I hope you enjoy the day. See you soon, Brian. Is this on? Is this thing on? <laughs> Happy birthday, Brian. Happy birthday, Brian. Cheers to the next decade. Hey, Brian. Happy birthday. Hope you're doing well. Hope the family's doing well. Happy 60th. Love you. See you on opening day, brother. Mr. Brian McKenna, how are you? Heard you had a big birthday coming up, so I wanted to be the first to say happy birthday, old man. Boy, remember when we were young? Look at these two things I pulled out of uh, my, my, my drawer. Look at that. I don't even think we were 30 yet. Remember that trip? I think same trip, but different place. Look at you. Look at you. But now, the big 6-0. Wow. Unbelievable. Remember we thought that was old? But anyways, 
There was another shirt you used to wear back during those trips. Uh, remember, birth, school, work, death. You remember that T-shirt well. I bet you still either have it or have pictures of it. I guarantee it. But anyways, you have three of the four boxes checked off. Let's keep it that way for at least 30 or 40 more years. A happy birthday, my friend. I'll join you in the 60 Club next month. Later. Brian, how's your whole family? Happy birthday. You are now old as shit. But you can shop at Market Basket between 7 and 9, Monday through Friday. AM, that's, that's pretty key. You are the music man, the weather man. You are definitely the sports guy. And now the first cabana boy that I've ever hired. I know Eileen thinks that you know everything about nothing. But I don't think that. You're the funniest guy in my truck. <laughs> You're the funniest guy at the bar. You're hilarious in the subway. Going to and from the Celtics. <laughs> and I can't wait for 30 days to pick you up off the ground, shit face drunk, celebrating your birthday once this bullshit is all over with. I hope I'm there with you. I value our friendship. Happy birthday. See you soon. Happy birthday, Brian! You're the man! Can't wait to celebrate when this is over! Woo! Happy birthday, Brian! Brian! Happy birthday, Brian! Happy birthday, Brian! Happy birthday, Brian. <laughs> Cheers! Hey, happy birthday, Brian! Happy 60th! It's gonna be a strange one this year, being locked in the house. And speaking of strange, I'm getting my own my own haircut here. Happy birthday, man! Congratulations and enjoy your day. Happy birthday, Brian. Welcome to the 60 Club. Hi, Brian. Happy birthday. You can join me in the uh, line at Market Basket for the senior hours. <laughs> Have a great birthday. Take care. Bye. Happy birthday, Brian. I hope you have an amazing day. I'm um, sorry you have to spend in quarantine. I know that sucks, but I know you guys will have a good time anyway. Um, I just want to thank you for everything you've done for me um, last summer. I could always count on you for everything. You drove me to my first day of work. You always kept the fridge stocked of Coke and uh, chocolate almond milk. I always had my caramel creams. Um, always had my ham and cheese and my toaster oven pizzas. So knew I was always taken care of. Um, one thing, I don't have a secret handshake with anyone else but you, so that's pretty special. Um, thank you for always supporting me with soccer. Your texts always made me laugh really hard. Um, uh, I hope you have a great day. Um, turn on some Slipknot, listen to some Lizzo, you know, drink a Bud Light for me, and get crazy, get stupid. Um, but enjoy your day. Love you guys, miss you guys, and uh, last thing I gotta say is OH. Hey Brian, happy birthday to you. Have a great day, see you soon. All is well here in Florida. 
Love you. Bye-bye. Hey, Brian. Dale. Happy 60th birthday from down here in sunny, beautiful, 78 degrees, Florida. I'm sure you're slightly envious. I know how much you guys used to love coming down to Florida. I don't know if you still do. Uh, hopes all's going well in Wilmington, and uh, congratulations on getting out and retiring. Uh, retirement life down here is pretty cool. Uh, wish things were a little different. I know we're all dealing with this stuff right now, but it'll work out. I hope everything's good. Uh, miss seeing you guys. Um, again, just hoping you have a happy birthday, and I'll talk to you soon.